Hello and welcome back to some more Car Mechanic Simulator 2014 and this is part number 12 and we're going to do this um, this path test as the part of the course. I'm guessing you guys if you watched the last episode you'd know that of course. So we're checking for suspension troubles. He said the journey is terrible so he's not very happy with the journey of his car. We're going to try and fix it and repair it and make him a one happy happy customer. Fingers crossed. All right. Move my front wheel onto the brake test. Obviously the brakes is not what we're doing so Break it up, there we go. Brakes seem okay-ish. <laughs> they seem a little bit dodgy. But um, we're looking out for suspension trouble really, I guess. Uh, hold down the brake. Okay, not that good, but it's okay. Um, this is when we're gonna see the trouble, I think. Oh, I'm being shaken everywhere. <laughs> like, the guy must be like, oh, not this test again. So that was the, the back one, wasn't it? That doesn't seem too bad to me. I don't know. I might be wrong. That seems bad. So that's the the back, isn't it? So, yes. That wasn't good. And so my phone just vibrated on the desk. You probably heard that a little bit. Apologies. Um, right. Now, we hopefully will load. There we go. <laughs> it's getting wide there for a second. So it seems to be the back. Let's bring that back up. We see some stuff under there. Um, was it the back? Oh, I think it was. Yeah, there it is. Oh, damage, damage everywhere. So does it want me to replace it? Yeah, replace that old one part, okay. So, take off the wheel. The bearings and stuff seem okay. The bearing on the, on the right there, the little yellow thing. That's good. But let me take off this. How do we take off this? Uh, doesn't mean say, does it? How do I take it off? Do I take the whole brakes off? I have to go underneath, maybe. Yeah, let's check underneath. Before I do anything else. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Just checking out the rear of this car. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, take this off. Yeah, there we go. So I was on the wrong, uh, wrong stretch there. Just gonna screw down there. Done. So that's the shock absorber rear. So let me take off this thing now. I'll take off the exhaust first. God damn it! How annoying is that? So annoying. Right. Take off now. Now we can. You know the exhaust is still sort of there. Take off this, which is 16%, which is not good. Suspension rear, obviously. So we take this one off as well. Take off that screw. Just about hover over it. It's literally the whole back of it is just wrecked. I mean, I haven't actually checked the front yet, but I probably should check it. Right. So let's go and purchase some parts. <laughs> right. Yeah, what we do is replace all the back bits. If you need to change the front bits, that's fine. But I don't want to see spend any more money than I have to because that sucks so I've got the rear the two of those they don't actually cost too much surprisingly and the springs cost much more so much. <laughs> how does that work just a spring right so now we can start putting this stuff back here assemble let's get this one in oh I can't get it there we go nice new one and then I've got to screw it back in can see what's going on there Put the spring back in. Nice sexy spring. Nice back end now. <laughs> this guy's got a sexy rear. Alright, let's put that's all this side out now. Actually get over there. Zoom in. There we go. Nice new one. Sweet. Put the spring back in. There's so many parts to a car, it's crazy. I've just got to fix this exhaust as well and put the um the tie back on because I took it off by accident. <laughs> Made a mistake there. Thought well, I had to take it off. Right. Put the car back down. Can't see I can see yellow parts in there, not red, which is a good sign. This car's definitely a mixture of um pretty new parts and pretty pretty shockingly bad parts. It's definitely coming to its end, I think. <laughs> It's starting to struggle a little bit. Alright, is that it? 
Done, done, done. Awesome. Quick little job there. Job number 40. Not, not bad. Happy about that. Not bad at all. So I reckon the jobs are gonna start getting a little bit more tricky. They've actually been a little bit easier the last couple of jobs. Yeah, here's one. This will be hard. <laughs> Great. Um, I can't believe how many problems I have with this car. My engine stops suddenly and it's, it isn't reliable. Okay. That doesn't really give me much information, does it? Um, that's a nice little full Mustang-y thingy. Just check the OSD, OB, OBD, God damn it. You know what I mean? So we could do a test drive as well, I think, because there's so many problems with it. We're probably gonna miss some. I wanna get as many parts checked as possible before we actually start taking parts off and uh, buying new ones, repairing parts, you know what I mean? Right. Let's see if we can repair any these parts we've got at the moment. A bit pointless, but I'm just interested. Nope. So I'll get rid of the broken parts we have. Try and keep on top of that. So I know exactly what I'm doing. 18, 8, and 10. All right, so that's done. What a fancy colour as well. I'm going slightly blind by that colour. It's quite, um. Oh, damn it, really? But can we do a path test? Is that not possible either? Damn it, that's not good. <laughs> that's really not good. I wonder if we can do any upgrades. Learning book. Uh, right. Let's do, yeah, one random part just randomly gets picked out. Let's do that. Uh, do it again as well, yeah. Should be fine. Right. So it's not sort of, um, it's having a few problems, isn't it? So just with the engine, perhaps it can be electronics. I don't know. Let's check. Examine. Oh, I can't see anything clearly from here. Aha! That's a problem. This is a V6 as well, so it might be on the other side as well. So I'll take the engine cover off first. I think we had a similar problem to this last time. The shocks are fine. The, the, sorry, the spark plugs. Mm. Alright. So let's go on the other side, see if there's any problems here as well. There is a problem over here. So these are ignition wires V6. So see if that if that's just a problem that'd be surprising, but I'm gonna go for it to see if we can uh, get this car done as soon as possible. Ignition wires V6. I need to buy two of those. Let's go back in. Did the ignition module work? It did work okay, didn't it? There we go. Yeah, it's all good. It's all good. Assemble. This work okay? Oh, it's 3%. Sorry, that does not work fine. Need to, need to repair that. Oh, can we repair that? No, we can't repair that. Man, these things actually cost quite a bit. That could be a problem. That's for sure. Ignition module 750. 705. Because I had the epic discount. I don't know if maybe like, he just like, the mechanic guy that I am at the moment is like, just very good with his words, but I'll just like, make up a good relationship with the the partners, are, I don't know. It's interesting. What? I bought two of those. Damn it, I didn't buy two of those. Sorry about that, guys. Take that off again. What, I bought two. Did I not buy two? Yeah, I got one. Oh, damn it. Okay, sorry, I bought two front ones. Oh. Did that even exist? God damn it, so I need to buy a... V6 rear, so I've got my rear one. Okay, god damn it. Sorry, guys. So sorry. Uh, I did not even realize that. I thought they were exactly the same. God damn it. That's a costly mistake. Damn it. Got it. All right. Let's assemble this. At least it's done, but hoping that's the only issue because that would cost me even more money. Right, done. Have we done this? We have done this. Oops. I think I forgot something. <laughs> you guys know what it is. It's the engine cover, of course. God damn it. Now, is it ready now? Please. There we go. Sweet. $2,000 to my name. So I think I actually spent more money on it. No. Actually. No, I think we still made money, but... Yeah, it's just annoying. Anyway. I bought this car cheaply. Um... But with an incomplete engine. What? Can you mount the missing parts and check it? Okay. Guess we can do that. 
Make the car drivable. Wow, this should be quite interesting actually. I'm trying to find the missing parts we haven't got. How much money do we get for this? 5,000, Jesus, okay. Right. Um, can't, ah, oh, so the, that bit there, battery. Uh, ignition stuff as well. Okay, this could be interesting. What about, let's check the oil first as well. It's not very basic stuff, but that's not too bad, it's pretty good. Um, check the oil filters. Yeah, that seems to be okay. Yep. So to find, ah, look at, ooh, that's interesting. It actually highlights bits as well. Hmm, interesting. So it's a buy alternator, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I can put that back in, please. No. All right. So I need to buy the tube and a battery and an alternator. Should be interesting. This should be interesting. Um, alternator, where are you? Alternator, there we go. And I need to buy the, it's just normal one, isn't it? So it's airflow tube. I need to buy a battery as well. I right, said so just start putting bits in and make sure this car works. Awesome. Battery in as well. Uh, I need to buy the ignition stuff as well so if we can do yeah there we go that's a bit better can we scan stuff oh no can't scan that god damn it i can't scan certain parts that's fine make sure that stuff isn't damaged but i don't think it's gonna be damaged i think it's just gonna be it's gonna be fine but i did find let's put the alternator on actually first and what belt is this what belt's this uh, let's take this. Let's assemble the alternator actually on first. Alternator! Oh, there you go. So what's this? No suitable parts. If I find out what this one is, I'll sure have to work it out. So we disassemble. You're picking, literally selecting all the run buttons now. I'm panicking. That's a timing belt, so that's the... I can't remember what it's called now. It begins with S though. I cannot remember what it's called. Where is it? There it is. Epic. Should now work. Just buying parts at a time. I don't want to buy too many parts and then do it all wrong. <laughs> but that would not be good. Alright, so that's all connected up. I can't see anything missing here. Um, gearbox is in. It's got two. Oh, starter. Get starter. Alright, let's go for that then as well. Almost missed the starter. Starter, starter, starter. Be interesting if I can if I miss anything. I know it does highlight um, like bits, but it's, it can, can be quite hard to see at times. Like the bits that are missing. Can't see it at the moment though. I mean, actually, most of the parts actually on it are actually pretty good condition. It's just missing random bits for weirdly. I don't know why. Uh, so I think that might be it for the obvious stuff. Make it drivable. Did we do this yet? No, it's incomplete still. Hmm. So we check the oil filters. Ah, sorry. Ooh, ignition. Ignition wires. I never forget those. This could be it. It could be it. It could be it. Ignition wires. There we go. One for one. Quite pricey. So let's assemble these. Uh, no. You not assemble those? Why doesn't let me assemble it? I'll have to take off that first. I don't know why, it's not even touching it. Assemble. I need to find the wires to. Uh, to oh, I need to buy spark plugs as well. I thought they were actually in there. So is that free then? I didn't realise that. Is that one alright? So to buy three spark plugs. So I wonder what was going on there. So I was like, why is it let me do it? 
Spark plugs. Where are you? There you are. One more. I already bought a starter, haven't I? Pretty sure I did. <laughs> I forgot already. Right. Spark plugs. Let's put them in. Select that. There we go. Zoom in. It's quite an interesting job, though. Finish my incomplete car. In. Now we can put this on as well. Uh, yeah, perfect. Put that one as well. This could be it. I don't know. <laughs> no, don't be saying I was wrong. Yes! Right, let's uh, take on this path test. Check the car's okay. We've done a pretty good job there. I'm pretty pleased. I'm pretty pleased. Do, 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 do. Right, let's brake. Brakes are pretty good condition. Now we've got the pots replaced. It's actually quite. It feels almost like a new car. She's um, I think that Yona pretty happy. Fingers crossed. That's pretty good. Ninety-five percent is awesome. It's like brand new brakes. That's so like someone's bought a new car and just taken parts out, and then just <laughs> sold it for like cheap or something. I don't know. It's weird. Ninety-five percent of it. Wow. So it's got an on-board on computer. And it's got a GPS navigator. Some telephone, it's got emergency as well. It's got sense, television, television. Jesus, a bit of high tech. All right, are we done with this one? I think we may be. Is it done? Is it done? Hopefully. As we wait for this epic game to load. There's so much, so much stuff to load in. All right, repaired. We are done. 5,000. Mm. We did spend a lot of money on parts though. So ignitions, um, spark plugs, alternators, battery, air tubes. Check the brakes. Just perform a general inspection. Okay. I guess we could do that the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Smack it a like, leave a comment below. This is job 43 out of 70. Still quite a few to go yet. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys soon. Bye-bye.